Here we are at Tierra Vida Bunchiti, Living Earth, here in the banana field. The bananas, bananas are a staple food for the Shipibo tribe here in the Amazon uh, because they produce year-round. Now, here in this banana field, we've added diversity, and we have a mahogany tree here that's planted in with a banana field that we've planted. And we have a cedar that's come in from natural regeneration from the cedars that we have nearby. So we take care of these trees that come in from natural regeneration and we reforest these mahoganies here. And the bananas make a great nursery for the trees. Now, Webster, we're looking for ripe bananas here. I want to show you how to cut a banana in, in a good way. Cut a banana right. Webster, hold the camera here and I'm going to cut the banana. Okay, ready? Now look up. You can see it's ripe. We're going to use these things, the dead banana leaves, we're going to pull it down like this as it comes to the ground, the tail, see that, I got the tail, look at those nice ripe bananas on there. These are the eating bananas that you'll find uh, all around the world exported, these are yummy bananas, here, eat them. you can eat them right off the field. Mmm, and um, yummy. Now when we do this tree, we got to be careful the resin on these bananas will stain your clothes bad. So you got to be careful. A lot of times I'll take some dirt and I'll put it in the bottom of the stem and that'll cut the resin from staining your clothes. You can see that? Get a little dirt, put it on the end. And that'll keep the resin from staining your clothes. Now let's get our bananas. And we've got to cut this banana all the way down. We don't want to leave it up like that. We want to cut the banana right to the base. If you don't cut the banana to the base, you invite disease into your banana field. You cut it down right to the base. And these baby bananas, these ones will grow up and be big bananas. Thank you so much for watching. Tierra Vida, Stones Guiding. See you later.